Climate Breezes are crown talking to rockabilly superstar Chris Isaac. And drummer Kenny Dale Johnson is here too. You must love Melbourne because I saw you both here in concert last year and you're back already. We keep coming back. We're like a bad penny. What is it that keeps drawing you back? What's not to like? Yeah. The weather's great. I love that dress. <laughs> Everything's beautiful. Now you're doing 12 concerts in under three weeks. Do you find that exhausting or does the adrenaline keep you going? No, not at all. I like playing a lot. To me, it's more, I'm much more nervous being on TV and um, talking about singing than I am singing. Are you nervous now? Well, you know, being in your presence is a little bit, I have to say, <laughs> it's a little bit nerve-wracking. I said, I'm walking downstairs, I said, well, who are we doing an interview with? They said, Lavinia, and I said, Lavinia? I said, then I went back up in the room, I changed, I showered, I redid my, my hair, God. you know, <laughs> it was a whole new thing. Now, if you haven't got your guitar tucked under your arm, it's a surfboard, isn't it? Are you going to yeah. have a chance to surf while you're here? I'm hoping I get a chance to surf, but, you know, I'm not... People know I surf, and they, people always ask me, are you going to surf here? Well, I love to, and the beaches are great, but I came to sing. So my number one thing is I want to make sure I do the shows right. What do you always get requests for when you're singing? Do people feel that comfortable that they can yell out, Chris, sing okay. this? All right, now, I, I was talking to Kenny. We were in the United States, and I said, you know something, Kenny? It was something that's, it was a bone of contention for me, and there's so many bones of contention. But I said, people are taking Christmas, and they're not taking the way it was meant to be taken. as a holiday for the families to get together and to love one another. They're commercializing. Hold that up a little higher. <laughs> they're commercializing the holiday. And I said, I want to make a record that takes the commercialization out of it. How'd you do? Pretty good. <laughs> And that's something you can give the whole family. Christmas time, this is the cheapest gift you can give them. Instead of spending 30 or 40 bucks, you get this, I don't know, what, what in, is this Inexpensive. Cost? It's not very, not cheap. it's not cheap, it's in, inexpensive. inexpensive. It's an inexpensive gift. Well, in spirit of Christmas and giving and everything, do you think the people at home would like a sample of what's on the CD? Ready, Kenny? Yes. <laughs> Bad little girl. to be good has got his eye on you so you got to be good I know it's hard cause you're far away but I'll be back on Christmas day till then let me hear you say you got to be good Every time I say bad little girls, I'm looking over at you. <laughs> I noticed that. Well, thank you very much for coming down and thank serenading you. me. That was unbelievable. I can, pretend can it's I, for me. Can, it's we just, really can I just say one thing to the people? If you haven't seen her in, in person, you're missing out because she looks even better in real life. And she smells a little like lilacs. Am I right? Yes. Take me. Shut it out with glee. Hey, Rudolph, Rudolph, the red-nosed reindeer. 